none other than BTS. <laughs> That's right, ARMY. This is a huge week for BTS. It is the comeback. Now, for some people, <laughs> they're thinking, hold on a second, BTS has been around for a long time. I don't remember them leaving. That's true, but the way that things work, when they have a new album come out, it's called a comeback. So Friday the 12th, their new album, Map of the Soul Persona, finally comes out. We get the album itself, we get a music video. <laughs> And on top of that, BTS is going to be the musical guest on SNL this week. Hi, oh, oh, Freaking out. Oh, you missed me. That is freaking huge. I, I'm gonna be bold and say that they are the first K-pop group ever to be on SNL. For those who are naysayers and might not be a BTS fan yet, you need to just throw away your expectations, wash away your criticisms, and just open up your soul because BTS is here to stay they're incredible, and we just want to give a huge congratulations to all the members. You guys worked so hard, and it shows. I've heard the album. It's amazing. You need to buy it. There are four versions. Please, 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 please go at least buy one in your local Target today. Congratulations again to BTS. You win the Apple of the Week, the best news story in entertainment news. But if you want to connect with us like we would love to connect with you, Please go to Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Search Borderline Entertainment. Like, comment, follow, subscribe, all of that good stuff. Be a part of the community today. But for Borderline Entertainment, I'm Asa. Be well, Borderline fans.